23-year-old Katie Kropis of Weymouth holds her 10-pound baby girl, Ellen Olivia, in the maternity ward of the South Shore Hospital. Found out at 10.15 they had the baby at 11.06. And it's been a whirlwind. Katie says she didn't know she was nine months pregnant until she went to the ER Tuesday, complaining of severe cramping and back pain. Ended up having an ultrasound. And with that, they were like, you're full term and giving birth now. She and her long term boyfriend were shocked as she was reportedly taking birth control and even having a pretty regular monthly cycle. At the time, I was like, this has got to be a joke. but. Um, you know, I, I, I had no idea what to think. Proud Nana says she received a call from Katie's boyfriend. Katie's nine months pregnant. We didn't know, and she's having a baby. And I said, ha, 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 put Katie on the phone. And he's like, Karen, this is serious. How soon can you get here? Katie says she didn't have morning sickness and didn't notice Ellie kicking. She says she did notice she was putting on some weight, but chalked it up to Christmas eating. She also says her feet were a tad swollen, but thought that was because she was putting in too many hours as a catering supervisor. I don't know. Um, I wish I had a better answer, but um, I think that just, you know, being on my feet all the time for work and, you know, Christmas is so busy as it is and just caught everything off guard. Nana says she didn't notice either. I've heard these stories over and over and you hear them and you think, oh my God, that's, you know, how did somebody not know and this and that. And I can tell you that this is real and true and it happens. South Shore Hospital says they've seen similar situations and first time moms like Katie may not know what to look for. They're not perceiving those symptoms, you know, whereas when you're on the lookout for them, you're waiting for it to happen. Now the family has some shopping to do. They don't even have a crib yet, but they're overjoyed and just happy everyone is okay. We're having a lot of fun so far, and I think that this is just the beginning. In Weymouth, Massachusetts, Katherine Sotnik, NECN.